Good morning. Today is Wednesday, June 8th. I'm Jane King for The Street from the NASDAQ market site in Times Square. Oil is building on its highest close of the year. Prices have nearly doubled since hitting 13-year lows earlier this year and did close above $50 a barrel for the first time this year on Tuesday. Energy stocks have rebounded as well, sending the S&P 500 to a 10-month high. While Alphabet meets with investors today, the Google parent company may have to face questions about the fate of its Nest smart device unit after its founder abruptly resigned last week. Google bought Nest for $3.2 billion two and a half years ago. With money from cash-rich Google, the smart thermostat building company went on a hiring and acquisition spree, increasing its employee headcount from 280 to 1,200 and buying the webcam maker Dropcam for $555 million. Now, the live streamed meeting also includes a vote on a shareholder proposal to address the gender pay gap. And Lululemon shares down in the pre-market after its earnings report. The fitness apparel maker says same store sales were up 3% compared to a year ago, but the results were still disappointing. Meanwhile, the company founder said last week that it has lost its way and needs a shakeup. Now, happening today, Pfizer's opiate pain management drug is considered by an FDA panel. Home bank shares split two for one. And the Jolt job opening survey is also due. That is a wrap for us. But be sure to track breaking news and analysis all day at thestreet.com at the Nasdaq market site in Times Square. I'm Jane King for The Street. Have a great day.